Hello everyone and welcome back to Pen Kitten Plays Outer Point of Sales 4 with the Golden Century expansion. Today I'm actually recording on the day where the expansion comes out. But by the time of this recording, by the time this goes live, it should be out for quite a while now. Hope you guys have been enjoying it. So we are back in Portugal. I have finally learned how to expel minorities. It has to be in a new world territory. So we might go there, but I would need to get more colonists. We are still pushing ever farther eastward. Over here. Oh, hey, look at that. Your name is Fernando de Sa, and there's actually a port over here called Fernando Po. Fernando can go and colonize Fernando. You, 988, come on. You're already here and repairing. Good, because I'm going to need you to do the mission as soon as that's done next month. Nice, nice, nice. We got 13,000 still sticking around here. Anybody going somewhere? I sent you, uh -huh. self-sustaining, gain prestige, nobility held diet down. You are gonna just chill out there with, how about Joaquim de Ovliera? Or maybe he could be used better elsewhere. I would like that colonist to come down there, because now we can reach it. You, if we have farther range, that means we can go east, western Indian Ocean, start going that way. You can just kind of stay there for now. I would need... How about that 5,000 army to come down to the Cape for now? Then we keep going. Also, I've been considering we need to get that tech penalty down, so why not just get rid of my entire nation again? Why not just debase currency all the way out of here until I have enough money to get me institution spread and brace? Which means this goes down. Pike and shot up. It doesn't... It doesn't stop our innovativeness going down, but at least it gets us closer to get that Renaissance thought. Those Renaissance thotties! Let's get put you down so that we get more administrative. You just have the Conqueror. You are going to be very good for us when you come around. You, one duck in a month. I would like to keep it that way. Let's just keep going. And actually, we got some spare parts. Dagbon, I know that you, from looking around, are willing to steer trade for us. Thank you. Send me... Yep, they've imagined this fate. Send me your money. I'm gonna transfer more and more and more. Portugal now has 40% in this node. Mostly it's Benin who has 19%. If I can get them 20%, I could get a trade battle with them. Down here, you're gonna come in. Unlikely that we're gonna actually suffer anything, but now we're starting to see these guys on that side. We're starting to see Kilwa and whatnot. So we need to start making money. We just need to start getting that. As for us, allies are already up and running, so how about neighboring countries just to use up my guy? Finished exploration, we can just, hmm, forgive usury, forgive indulgence for stability. We just can keep trying to get that Pope job. I would like to be able to be Pope, but unfortunately, cannot. Western Indian Ocean, we gotta keep going. We already reached the Indian Ocean. We need to get there in like five years to be on par with actual history. Over here, Milan and... Oh! You have taken Milan there to Venice. There will be blood. Also, I see a Croatia that exists. The Serbia. Bohemia. Terrible border gore between Austria and Hungary. Poland eating up Hungary. Ottoman just sitting around doing nothing. France, you're fine. England, you're fine. You still have Calais. So there's still wars for you to be fought against the French. Over here, this area, autonomy, unrest is still zero, so that's good. You can no longer explore down this way. However, we can start making trade connections with the Kilwa. Hmm. Not interested. A military axis, they would say yes. How about we just improve relations with them over time? You can go ahead and protect trade. Now in the Cape of Good Hope to keep you in this region. Cape of Good Hope, we're going to be there a while. You need to come back. You're starting to hurt yourself. You're starting to hurt yourself. Come on back. The uprising is imminent in Jovalov. We'll fight him. We'll be able to fight him off. Perfectly fine with me. Uh, back along to the co, the keep, the Capo de Bao Esperanza. Obviously, we're going to make a new trade company. Those loans, I can, I can keep debasing my currency, but we're hurting it when it comes to that corruption. Also, are you just sitting around like you were? Yeah, I don't know why they're doing this. I mean, I don't necessarily care, but at the same time, come on. Morale of armies down. Conversion of the Congo. Congolese Manen Congo Henrique I. 
Hands at the urging of our missionaries embrace the Holy Mother Church and the One Faith. The Congolese have already calling out for priest Bibles and aid establishing the local church so they can give the Congolese Manag Congo and now the Catholic brother Monarch has pledged his friendship to our kingdom and is helping and leading him in the one, one true faith. Indeed there, Congo, indeed. You are now actually threatened by us, but you wouldn't you wouldn't give in to us. You have more than 100 development. But you are at the very least threatened, which is good. You don't want to give up trade power, though, but you are threatened. You can purchase a new ability. How about... War taxes? Transfer subjects? Sounds good. All we want from you, Congo, is your money. So I don't, you're a Christian. That's great. We can start doing some trade deals. Trade deals that don't exist in this game, but still good for you. Yuda and the, the God of the Oriel can come on back to... Let's say Lisboa to start with, because if we have a Moroccan uprising, the Protestant Reformation has come. If we have a Protestant uprising, no, not the Protestants, the Moroccan uprising, we could have some problems there. We don't really need much help in the unrest down here or in Angola. This area, I doubt we're going to have much problems, but only 80 a year. Unfortunate. Ah, I know. We can start going to other members. You are ah, the dominance of the clergy is annoying. Let's see. Send them to establish new world order for native assimilation and chance. They need to have higher. Ah, it's not until actually has that gone away yet? Just in case. Yeah. When is that going to stop? Population is up a hundred. That's great. But still, when are you just going to stop it? Stop this madness. I could give over this province, which was owned by the clergy before. When are you going to go away? The clergy has been curtailed. What does that mean? Because that used to be your province. We own Porto ourselves. I could give over Swepta again. Rain falls on the western coast of Africa. Ba, 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 da, ba, ba. Hmm. Dagbon is about to finish their colony. I don't know how they got colonists, but they did. Kilwa. Aha, Kayor. They've, rose, they've risen up, and now they're dying. Have a good day. Defensive planner, Joaquim de Oveira. Ah, nice. Good for you. Ava simulation. Again, another hundred. Going good. Going pretty good. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> ah. What do you know? We're collecting slaves down there. That, uh, that's lovely. Oh, that's hot. As for us, let's check on our... Ooh, Renaissance Thon is almost done. Nice. That is good. Renaissance Thought would put us... Let's see. You're Miltech 7, but Admin Tech 6. You are Miltech 7. 7. What about some of these guys? 7, 7, 7s? We're Tech 6. So we just... No. We are... We're also Tech 6. So yeah, we'll be coming up with them. Call Merchant. I want that Renaissance Thoughts. We can now take an idea group. Uh, we don't want to take two diplomatic in a row. Expansionism would give us the additional colonists, which al would allow us to fill in our colonies and allow us to start on uh, Brazil. So I think expansionist is good for our starting position, although it's going to take us a long time to get up to 400 to take that additional colonist. I don't think anyone else is taking it, so that's good. Sakala, Sakalva. Any of you guys want to give me some uh, sip? Hunting pirates. In Sevilla, lose trade or lose. T okay, hunting pirates, it is. Military leader has left us. The general has died. You are coming pretty far along, although we are very. Uh, trade dispute against Morocco, you say. Blockade their ports, you say. They're allied with the Mamluks, you say. Kabul would unfortunately join them, which is unfortunate. How about we dissolve the alliance with Kabul? Mm, pull back from that, so you're free. Must wait a day to get another offer. Get an alliance with Congo, just because. So that we can request maps. Yeah, request share maps would be nice. Let's, where's my navy? I need to bring in my whole army, if at all possible. Bring them all in. Then what we can do is go to war against Morocco and Mamlux. Get them all to give their trade to me. Although Mamlux might not be necessary. Because they go to... Ah, good. They go... No, they can't even come to Tunis, can they? No. Alexandria goes straight into Genoa. 
which is not that useful, so maybe just take a little bit from them. So long as Castile would be willing to join us as they insult me on the inside. Let's see if they would. No, Castile wouldn't even want to because trust is down. Castile! Stop it! Well, we can go ahead and spend favors to increase the trust. And now what do you think? You would join us. Nice. Kabu is unfortunate because that means I would take over Kaior. To the point where I might want to actually just leave this army there. And bring over these 5,000 that I have sitting around in the Cape. You come over. I'll keep those 7,000 there. But a battle in Morocco. Sunny and Suerte take over. It's a blockade them kind of war. Can no longer steer trade from Kabu. Oh boy, don't just you worry. You, a royal marriage with the Congo, as they are now good Catholics. Influential trading family, or gain a skill to trading advisor. Uh, the trade, please. We are going to have severe problems with our treasury. We can offer knowledge sharing to them at a cost of 0.85 a year. I will happily take this deal, just because it'll get them up and running to be a nice Christian nation inside of the Congo. Although, if I look at their religion map, they're still fetishist, but I will I will change them myself. As for us, we're just going to have to keep going. By getting Morocco to give me their trade, by getting... Kabu would just uh, send me their trade. That's not really much of a problem. Although I might want to... Nah, nah, that wouldn't work. It would be a trade war and train outside the house. Da -da 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 -da. Yeah, you there. Come on in. Sit right down. Then 13,000 men. It's not the most, but it'll do. Let's get a new... Bartolomeo... Nope. Bartolome... Ah, that's a weird name. Bartolome. This force is good, so we will have them blockade enemy ports in... West African Sea. It might be a bit dangerous. Then this is Atlantic. If I go North Atlantic, it'll focus... It'll just focus on Saleh, then. We need to blockade enemy ports in Western African Sea, although that will come down to Kabu as well. You'll stay there until that war is finished. Then as for us, with the combined forces of Portugal and Castile, with Castile backing me up, Mamluks, 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 they'll be able to bring in a lot of, I'm guessing, we're going to take a guess and say galleys, military, Navies, Mamluks. They have two heavy ships. They have 11 galleys, 6 light ships, and 16 transports. Hmm. The Castilians have 7 heavy ships. The Castilians are not going to be beat on the seas by the Mamluks. Mamluks are allied with Ketaman, Morocco, and then Beja. So we could also bring in Ketaman, but there's not really that much of a point. Uh, let's see. Down to Kabul. They are allied with Jenai and Timbuktu, so I'm not really interested in those. No, so bring in Castile. Cabo cannot, because we have a trade against them. Following peace options are disabled. Basically everything. It's just... Show, oh, it's a sub, oh, it's a show superiority war. Even then, we have the crossing at Gibraltar. We have Suerta to hold on to. We just need to take good fights. Over 10% of the war battles of war. Unfortunately, that's not a... Blockade war, but it'll do. Now with this army, move in. And with you, go there. You're a bit uh, on the bad side, but yeah, start going down to Suerta. At least hold in that area. We know of them in Ifni. We'll just keep going. And, oh, I got another merchant. wonder where I got that from. I can send them down to the Ivory Coast, of course. Transfer trade. Tiempo. That'll just help things along, getting all the trade from down there. So, in terms of armies, they actually have more than us, but in different regions, and also with the power of Castile, good luck with that. We are Western nations. Bring it on. No three leaders left us. That was the Explorer, so we're going to have to get another one when that colony finishes. Suerta will be a good place to hold on to a nice battle. You can hold there for now. That's where their fleet is. We can do what we can. Still making money because we're knowledge sharing. Net straight up knowledge. 
They're going to go into these provinces and take them out. That's going to hurt our trade prospects in the short term. I'm guessing the Mamluks are going to come through Tunis just by land. They won't have to worry about it too much. Uh, let's see. You are sending in your force. That's great. But we're going to have to deal with... You have a bit of siege. That's, that's good. And wait. We already passed the point we can have the large cannon. Is that worth it to me? I guess we have enough money. Where did, where's that being made? Algrave. Works for me. Yeah, we'll get the value cannon. If we're going to be doing that, we will get the value cannon. You are pretty good. You are taking Mazagao, taking all of your provinces. Uh, the unrest is now down somehow. Swarta, you are going to jump across the water. Don't see him coming yet. We might as well go to Swarta. They're going to take point at Fez. As long as we can back him up in Fez. Get our cannon going. We need something to do with our you with our time. How about uh, additional allies? So that's just going to go between England and whatnot. You. I've already done with you. You. Proof relations. Congo has no possible rivals and I am a friend of theirs so they should like me. Colon Colonial company goes bankrupt. Population settlers in Cairo change by 90-50% or lose 50 ducats. Lose the ducats. I want that colony up and running. We're already past the point where it's 1498. Still don't see any Spanish colonies in the Americas. Had to take a loan, which means we're going to be under for a while. Hugo de Suerta. Political struggle. The clergy gain influence. Chair. Still don't know what it's going to take to get the clergy to be curtailed. It's, it's not informative. Oh, Cabo has gone for Costa de Oro. Uh, okay. So, no, nine of us could get access through Jolof? Come back from... You. Yeah, come back from you. Just ask for military access. Because we can see their army. It's seven. We have seven. But then again, we did give Gabu... Yeah, you. Go to there. We have too many alliances. Or so they think. Sale. Going between... Europe and there it's going to be annoying you're going to devastate my province which is annoying and it was given to Morocco because you don't even care about it yeah I'm sh uh, Enrique de Trasamara has Castile has died as such there goes our statesman hmm interesting they're going to Tetuan we have 32,000 here if they go on to Suerta we could have a bit of a claim you to hills I prefer if we could fight on Suerta. Maybe we can try to drag them out by standing on there. Because if they attack in Fez, well, we're going to have the problem. Hmm. Let's see where they're going. They keep enforcing. Down here. God was just going to be under siege for a while. Oh, and they're going in for Fez. Honestly, Spain, that's what you get. It's what you get. I know this will impact us, but that is what you get. That's what you get for taking an attack in the mountains. You have just infantry. Yeah, fall back. We'll take him in Suerta. Come on. It's not like we haven't done this before. We'll take them as they come into Suerta. <laughs> God damn it, Spain. You're supposed to be the muscle here. Come on. Get with it. Hmm, global tariffs, colonial range. Colonial range could be useful, but maybe in a minute. Come on, get your shit together and let's get back in there. Oh, what's this? Fraticelli. Hmm. You go ahead and blockade any ports in West African Sea. Just spread out. The Tower of Belem. Those 50 ducats get local defensiveness. Yeah, we gotta do it. You know I had to do it to him. Spain. Where are you going Spain oh you're in another war Swedish war for independence of course you decide to get into another war hmm we don't have enough to actually come over to Suerta and they decided to go and get stuck into another war and care about that war instead S Castile hmm
Hmm. We'll probably get Gabo out. Not sure what we're going to do about this. Because Spain has decided to just screw off with their troops. Unless you have a wild plan to come around into Mamluk territory this way. I think you're just giving up on me. Let's see. If I get the Armada together. Armada Real. You're the trade fleet. You. Just get all the ships back together in the coast. We're going to have to hold there. Make sure they can't cross. Ah, Spain, 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 Spain. Can you professionalism? That's nice. Of course you say, oh yes, we have an, we were defeated because we decided to take a fight in the middle of the mountains, and then, uh, how about we just, uh, go this way? Let's see. Who are you fighting? You're fighting... What? You're fighting the Palatinate. That's where you decided to go. You decided to go to the Palatinate and to Denmark. Spain, why must you fail me? Of course, you have to lose one fight and then leave forever. <sighs> What's this now? Longer any separatists. It's not a problem for us, right? It's not good. Rebel uprising in Morocco. I th I think that's hilarious to me because let's see. Up on zero 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 zero. zero. Meaning it's going to come out in Suerta. Do it now, I say. I demand you do it now. Hmm. Can't even distract them. Castile's decided to just leave. Ah, <sighs> Spain. Castile, why are you like this? What are you taking there? Just end the war quickly. And Queen Consort, Regent Ilnu, Conquistador Joaquim de Oviera, has died. Okay, so now this troop is... Without support, and why is it taking so many casualties? Huh. There's 7,000 here. So you just swept those over. So now they're just going to be sitting on that for a while. I have nothing but patience. I can sit here and wait. As for this, Siege of Gabu is over. Nice. Push on. And also get a new guy. Get a new general. Another Diaz. I have to come through this way and get fighting done. We could go and attack Gabu. They have tech 5 to our tech 8, I would say? Yeah, tech 8. So they should lose with equal forces, although I don't know why we're not getting troops. Moving 50% of the distance is the next problem. Hmm, weird. The Mamluks and us are just going to sit around. They're going to cause a lot of devastation. Cosbelli has ended. Spanish... Have you, wait, have you joined with the... Oh yeah, they decided to declare war on Sweden, so now the Spanish are going to go and mess around Sweden with 23,000 just in Stockholm. Of course you are, Castile. Why not? Why would you not? Also, these Jalafians I'm going to have to take care of. Influenza. Quarantine. Kayor. Uh, well, we'll just let that be for a second while we take care of this war. Kabu, you still have high enthusiasm because you haven't destroyed your army. They're going to get ticking war score, but we can sit and they can sit. Both sides can just sit on this for a long time. I could go war taxes, come to think of it. Let's see, where would I get war taxes? It would be in here? No, it would be in economy. Yeah, raise war taxes for two years. Sure. Birth of colonialism. Where did, where did it start, by the way? Institutions... Starts in Nantes? In, in Brittany? France, do you have colonies? I do Why did you get colonialism? That's my question. But it's already well past the point of this video. Thank you for watching. I'll see you guys then. Bye bye!